And we are back playing The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Today, I think we'll try an Eden run since I have five tokens and I don't know exactly what Eden's all about. I believe you get a, like a random assortment of items and like abilities. And I got my reflection and soul converter. And I get HP up, which is, which is nice. But my tier, my rate is so bad. And I get a pill, range, I mean... That seems like a that's a really good pill to actually get, especially when you're starting with this shitty my reflection garbage. And like our our range is high, is that it? And our damage is whatever, and our everything else is whatever. So we got we're not we're not starting off great. Could be better. But we'll find out as as we go on. There's a red poop on the first floor. There's a tinted rock right there. Oh my god, I walked right into it. I don't remember how Soul Converter works. I think it's two... Yes. It is two Spirit Hearts for one Red Heart. So if we can somehow find uh, uh, Guppy's Paw, we can... We'll be rolling. We could be rolling in uh, hearts because we can get ourselves to the max like that, I believe. We'll see what our tiers got. Our first room with actual combat. And my reflection is already pissing me off. It takes three tiers to fucking kill a fly. So we're looking for damage. Because Eden's really fucking me in the butt right now. And in case you didn't know, not the biggest fan of that. Just sharing some preferences with you. Like, some people are, but it's just not, it's not up my alley, if you get what I'm saying. So... It'd be nice if Eden would screw off. Eden's hairstyles always are different or something like that, I believe. So that's the only cool part, because the person looks different every time. Nope, and you farted and you butterbeaned me. Congratulations, you did nothing. So our first boss is going to be going to take forever to kill. If we're going to continue with this right here. Because we're doing nothing. Like, in, I missed, like, what, one room? So, we're hoping to deal some damage here. I'm just going to stand over here and wait. Ah, uh, like, the damage. It's real how bad this is. Gemini is going to take... Like, even my last run, when I... Like, all I got was, like, Technology 2. Like, that was slow. But it, this is making it, this is making me just embarrassed to even have to deal with this. Because, like, this is just abysmal. Not even cool. So, hopefully we can get a damage upgrade in some way, shape, or form. I could trade those spirit hearts I have for red hearts. Probably should, because I don't have anything generating spirit hearts for me. So there's no reason to actually keep them. Especially this early on in the game. It's better off having... I find it's better off having red hearts. But that's just myself. Oh, fuck right off. I might keep them just so I can have a chance with the devil on the next floor. I mean, I don't have anything to trade. Like, I've never ever heard boss room music go, like, to this... This point where it's, like, this part of the soundtrack. I don't think I've ever heard it. Or been conscious of it, because like I was, because like this boss fight is so easy, it's unreal, and we get a range and speed upgrade. Right, I guess we're going down. So hopefully we can get some sort of magic on this floor. Work your magic game. Okay, that's not the magic we're looking for. I feel like this run is going to be a real sh crap shoot, and it's going to be over soon. Oh, uh, yes. Yes. Mm, yes. Very good. Fuck off, please. That was just terrible dodging. Never mind. Never mind anything else, but like... It's just that it takes so many damn shots to kill one stupid fucking fly. Like, I get that it's first, second floor, but like, come on. I believe Isaac's starting damage is like three or something like that. Now we have two. Yeah, I can't even use soul converter. Um, 
just get out of this. I want to go to the my item room. I need a key. I just want to not get hit by these stupid little poos. And my reflection does not help. It does not help whatsoever. So this might be a quick one, because we're not, we don't have great items. We don't have anything going for us, really. All we have going for us is that we had a couple spirit hearts to start. And a health upgrade. So like, that's, that's about it. There is an arcade. I mean, I don't know how I'd be able to use that for a benefit. Could gamble. Ooh, how scandalous. But I mean, I can't imagine it doing anything positive. Other than giving me, getting me down to half a red heart. Yeah, like this room is hard just because we do so little damage that like they can blindside you and fuck you up. So we got leech. Um, the sad part is I think I might be relying on leech for my damage. Okay, please hurry the fuck up. So like nine lives. Nine lives in the devil room is like my saving grace right now, I believe. I mean, I came in here just to come in here, but like it's not great. I could go and donate money so I can at least do something productive on this run. I mean, it's Monstro. Monstro is not that great. We're just, like, Leech is doing our damage, though. Leech is actually doing... Yeah. So, we're relying on Leech right now, so that's not really... It's just disappointing, because Leech is fucking useless. I mean, if it was, like, Pinking Shears or something, like, where you chop your... The, where you, the body just does a ridiculous amount of damage, maybe I'd be like, oh, yeah, sick. I can understand relying on that, because that does a lot of damage, but Leech is just... Poo. And it, it heals you. Yes, I get that. So it's like Charm of the Vampire, but you have to, like, activate it and stuff, but... Still, not great. This is a real complain run. Complain, complain, complain. That I got screwed by an Eden run. So, hopefully, you can get something going. Got Tears. That's something. There's this. The mark. It gives me a spirit heart. So I, I mean, I guess that's a trade I was willing to make. I needed that like I need damage. Like there's no there's no question about it. Like that it's not like as I guess I needed to make that trade, I needed to make that trade. I guess we'll go explore the rest of the floor. And it leads nothing. Um, secret room. Right here. Nope. That was dumb. I don't have a key, so I can't get in there. Don't know why I was trying to. I didn't actually run into the door like an idiot. Not yet, at least. I was going to. I was thinking about, oh, let's go to the shop. Ah, uh, wait. I don't have any keys. Can't do that. So now we're on the caves. Enemies are definitely a lot harder, especially like these bats. These bats are real assholes. Like, give me the ability to fly or something. Then I wouldn't be complaining. But, I mean, I'm going to complain no matter what. Until, like, I one-shot everything in a room no matter what. Automatically. Until I have that ability, I will complain about everything. But, ah, god damn it. I got stuck there like an idiot. Like, I was just about to say, what can we get to help us here? Um, our damage is not god-awful anymore, so I mean, it's either a lot more damage, nine lives, something. Something to sustain our ability to play. That's what we're looking for. Oh my god. Stupid, big, fucking fat spiders. This looks like it is it. Unless I get a spirit heart off this room, I think that we're going to come to an abrupt end here. Especially, like, I cannot stand those big stupid spiders. Oh, and we got bonies. Bonies are the bane of my existence. 
IE right there. That took 10 minutes. I didn't mean to restart. I wasted myself a token. But I guess we're gonna gonna try this version of Eden. Because I believe I have Sacred Heart. So, I mean, you can't go wrong with that. We're gonna get fire rate up. I bet, I think that's just a damage downgrade plus fire rate up. But, we're gonna, hopefully, like, I feel as though with this setup, we should be able to just mow down enemies. Get one damage upgrade. We got four red hearts. Like, this is a, because, I mean, at least in Rebirth, Sacred Heart was just an amazing item. Because it, it, it's shot speed slow, but it tracks like a mother. So if I can get some range, and, I don't know. A range, a little more damage, I think I should be comfortable. And a way to generate uh, spirit hearts or something like that. You know, something something that you always want. Maybe an orbital. Orbital's good for me. I'm not great at dodging, so I'll, I'll always take an orbital. Because I don't, like, I'm not in practice enough to actually be good at dodging shit. So Who'd we get? Oh, look at that. Our old friend, the leech. Yeah, like, our tears do quite a bit of damage. It's just a, ah, it is a shot speed up. It's not what I wanted. I should have thought about that before I picked it up. But, I thought it was more than that. I thought it was, like, a shot speed up plus, like, a damage, but that's what Cat of Nine Tails turned into, not, uh, Magic 8 Ball. Magic 8 Ball is still a piece of crap and only gives you shitty spot, shot speed up, and that. So we got Mongo Baby, who, or Mongo Friend, sorry, who's not 100% sure what he does. Each room he does something different, or he follows someone, or... I'm not positive. I'll probably figure it out eventually. It's nice to be one-shotting these flies, considering our last, the last run, we could barely even kill them, because our my reflection baloney. So now my reflection with this wouldn't do anything, right? Because like it would reflect, but it's still trying to find the enemy, so it's gonna still go get him. And we got ourselves a spirit heart to protect ourselves, so we can hopefully snag ourselves a little dealio with the devil here. Oh, that was our last second dodge. Pill. I found pills. Hmm, how useful. No, there isn't a rock. I wanted to wait for that stupid banner to go away so I can at least try to find one. Um, oh, this seems like a hard room. We can one-shot these guys. It's, like, as you can tell, Eden, this is like a perfect example of how an Eden run can be god-awful or something really, really good. Oh, uh, I guess I'll pop this. Give me, oh, a little brimstone. Ay, 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 ay. And you're dead. And we... Basement boy. Yay, I didn't take any damage, I believe that's what it is. We got three red chests. So, this is actually... I enjoy this one, actually, because goat head. For one. So, oh, oh, there's a penny. Thank goodness it stayed open, so I can get it. And we've gone everywhere, I believe. This is a good way to get basement boy, by getting... Oh, and Samson. Now, let's... Oh, nope. Can't do anything in here. I thought I could. I thought there was a... I actually thought there was a room, like, down to the bottom. So, if we all of a sudden got guppy by some... Or mulligan, or something like that, our flies would do ridiculous damage. I'm gonna try to get Eve here and not pick up any red hearts. Just so I can unlock both of them here. I don't know why I popped that. Just because... Give me crappy dry, but I mean dry is not bad. Dry is actually really good, dry baby or whatever it's called. But just on like on a one room, it's not gonna, especially a room like that, it's not gonna save you. I'm gonna try my very best not to pick up any hearts. Okay, what do we got in here? Got ourselves a red fire. Oh, baloney. I was trying not to. Oh, those are ours. I found pills and 
question marks. Um. Uh, I want to unlock Eve. Because I might be able to... Uh, that doesn't matter. I'm still, I'm still not picking that up. I would like to unlock Eve. And this seems like it's going to be the run to do it. Because I can, like, well, one-shot, two-shot everything. Oh, wow. Hello. Bloody rage or bloody lust. No, toxic blood. Anemic. So whenever you get hit, you leave a trail of blood. Which I'm hoping not to get hit, so... I'm hoping I never have to use anemic. So now, now that I got uh, that shot speed upgrade, my shots are going a little too fast. Mom's purse. Good item. If I can find a trinket. <laughs> a couple of trinkets. Gertie J. Rotten baby. Wow. Yeah, that... Uh, I believe the one fly that Rotten Baby produced just shit all over Gertie J, so... That's good. We like that. So if we could get actual Rotten Baby permanently, that would be sick. Nope, I thought I could go in there. Curse of the Blind. You don't know what the items are, I believe. And uh, I don't think I really care. I'm just going to pick it up. Because I can't... I'm not picking up hearts, right? Which is what I'm I'm going for. I'm going for not pick up any red hearts or hearts in general. Pop up, please. How many shots do you think these guys are going to take? Two. And thankfully, they home right in. There we go. Onward we go. Here's our one first special room, and it is what we would like to call our item room. I don't know if that's what they're actually called. Let's get rid of that fire first so it can't poke us. And we get... Spoonbender. <laughs> we don't know what the item is, but it is a useless item because we already have homing tears. Come on, don't hit me, please. Get in there. There we go. I think picking up spirit hearts is picking up hearts because it says no picking up hearts in general, right? So I, it makes sense that that can't pick those up either. Yeah, let's open it. What is it? Bob's Rotten Head. Not great. But we'll use it. Right here. Nope. Not there. Good to know. And onward we go. Oh, my nose is so itchy. Oh, bonies. Why do you... Why, why must you do that? Because I was trying to get, uh... Because I got Basement Boy, I was trying not to get hit on this floor either. And get whatever the achievement is for this one. Because I'm bad at dodges in the first place, so... If I can get any help, it's what I... I mean, this is... This would have been the run to do it, right? So... Pop your stupid head up. Today, please. I asked nicely. Thank you. And we get two of clubs. This is doubling your bombs. We'll fight Mega Fatty and then see if we can get any bombs off of him. Oh, I got big fan. And then... He's dead. Mega Fatty is quite a strong enemy. Eek. And in here we get... Oh, fuck off. We get such a bad item like that. Why did I blow that up? I wasn't going to take it anyway. Now I gotta try to... Uh, that Dead Sea Scrolls can go fuck itself. Really? Okay, I guess we're going down. I gotta avoid all the red... Oh, never mind. Is it only one floor? Either way, we unlocked Eve. So now we can pick up as much shit as we want. Oh, I walked right into that. And I walked into it twice. Okay. So now that we're done being bad, we're gonna try to be a lot better. And that was an easy room. Anything of significance over here? I don't believe so. I thought the tinted rocks were like these rounded suckers right there. Or like that's the shape that they come in. 
Eh, I don't know why I did that. But that's a uh, little sissy, or whatever her name is. I think that's what it is. And she just drops little spiders for you. And she might do damage too. I'm not 100% positive. Ooh, a dime. I was gonna say, ooh, a lucky penny. But no, it's a shiny old dime. Pow. Stealing keys. And we got Polyphemus. So, we're gonna fuck enemies' days up, I thought. Gotta hit them in the back. Oh, poo. Stand up. Come on, run. Run on my toxic blood, please. Okay. If I could hit him in the back. There we go. I think that was uh, Mongo, Mongo, little Mongo, Mongo baby, Mongo friend that did that. Spirit Heart, we'll pick it up. Hey, there's options. I want to donate, because I got to get this sucker up. Because the maximum is like $9.99. And that's a long ways away. <laughs> We're not even a, a tenth, tenth of the way there, so. Yeah, the nice part about this is I can screw up these big ding the dingles with one one thing and it still travels through them I believe at least that's what it looks like no it just blows up on so I, I can do enough damage with each tier to screw up a dingle this is depths one. Oh, demon baby that's always nice and fuck off monstro Two. Monster 2, sorry, I won't demean you what your rank. You're not monster 1, you're number 2. Blue cap, more health, always helpful. Angel room, three spirit hearts. I feel like I can kill it. Nope, I can't do that yet, apparently. I can't blow up the statues yet. I thought you could blow them up, but apparently not. I'm gonna go explore. We got lots of time. And run the fuck away. Two bombs. Oops. Oh! Jeez, I thought I ran right back into that. That scared the crap out of me. I mean, there's nothing left on this floor. What am I doing? I might as well go... Oh, Jesus. Running too quick. I was hoping... Uh, anything in here? Double check. Nope, nothing. So I can blow up the statues, but I can't fight them yet. I think I need to beat the cathedral or something to do that. I'm not 100% positive. I don't know how that works. Well, that was... Yeah. Like, our damage is redonkulous right now. And I say redonkulous just because it's so good I can be a douchebag. Yes, in case you didn't know. Once you become so powerful, you can be whatever you want. Oh, hello, Mr. Green. And he dropped us a random pill. Do I want to use it? Not really. Let's use this. Blood bag, thank you. I was waiting for that. That's pretty much why I was playing it, because I want to unlock the blood bank. And, oops. No, just give me anything. Like, I'm surprisingly confident with how much damage I have that I'm going to play the blood bank. Because I... Oh, wow. Hello. Please screw off. Up here. Thank you. I don't one shot those guys, which is kind of sad. Wish I did. Left hand. So, this is a nice. I, oh, really? Maybe I shouldn't have played the Blood Bank. Because I'm kind of fucking myself in the butt here by taking ridiculous damage. Like, damage I should. Getting hit by is the stupidest things. Please hold in. No, nope, whatever. We'll wait. We get three spiders, which are gonna do so much damage. We'll see what we got in here. More money. So I got seven minutes to go find my item room, the boss room, and the shop because I am going to find the shop. And we're gonna put that there. Oh, really? Oh my God. Like I was trying to 
run, like, by it, but I ended up running straight into it, like a jackass. Give me something, come on. One. Oh. Makes up for my own stupidity. E. coli? I think? Yeah. Dirty touch. I think I, when I kill, when I touch enemies, yes, when I bump into them, they turn into poo. Something like that. Where's the last guy? He's got to show up here somewhere. Oh, thankfully my little spider friend there wanted to take get rid of him. So if I kill enemies by touching them, they turn into poops on the ground. Not like those kind of poops, but like the poops, normal poops that you can shoot and get items out of. So we're working our way along here. Our damage is so good, it's not even a question. Like we don't need anything. We just need to not get hit. The, yeah, right now the goal is don't get hit. Because like that's just pure decimation. So I'm going to go back and look for my shop. Because I, I haven't found on this floor yet. It's got to be, I mean, really there's no option. Oh my goodness, I do it. Oh! Wow. Okay, so I got hit twice on this one. Like a, like an asshole. Shouldn't have. Fanny pack. Every time I get hit, goodies fall out of me, I believe. I don't know what that pill is. It might be something good, but we'll never know. Donated the rest of our money so we can live happily. And onward we go. Hopefully we can mop up the boss fight here. We'll pop that just because. Little haunt. Good item. The fear will be nice to have. Yeah, like the amount of damage we were doing was a bit ridiculous. Speed ball, speed and shot speed up. Not too happy about the shot speed up, but it's how she goes sometimes. Guppy's head. We're taking that. We don't know what any of these pills do. I don't want to know what they do. Just for the sake of not wrecking my run. We're coming in here. We've got sad bombs, scapular, magnet, and spider butt. Um, I guess scapular? Oh, cool. I guess I'll run right into you, actually. Fuck off, Gertie. Really? Not cool, Gertie. Fuck off, please. At least every time I get hit, I can get goodies. So we're gonna hopefully mop these guys up. Because I gotta do boss rush with uh, Eden eventually. And it's it's one that you, once you get done, you don't want to deal with ever again. Like, you'll, you can come and steal the items out, but you don't want to have to actually fight it. It's a pain in the ass to fight. Really, Eyeball? I don't think you hit me. The only nice part about this is you only take half hearts. The fact that I'm taking, I've taken almost half of my health already. Okay, I'm at, pretty much, I'm pretty much at half my health. Damn, taken. Oh my god. Uh, you wanna fuck off, please? I don't deserve these items that I have. Obviously, I'm just squandering them away and getting hit over and over again. Now we're in red hard territory, so... So we can just pick up red hearts that we find. So I'm not too concerned about that. Because there are a lot of red heart drops. And I will generate my own with my fanny pack. But those spirit heart loss just... Oh, fuck. Those stupid goddamn red poops. They just piss me off. At least these poops are giving me some money. I don't need it, but they give me money. Okay. Little Chad, see you later. Just gotta stay away from the right side of the the baseball, the court over there. Don't wanna take in damage from that. Gertie and Chubb. Should be easy. Is Chubb already dead? No. 
I thought red heart, uh, those red poops do damage to these guys as well. So it'd be kind of cool if you could uh, get the red hearts to like uh, red poops to be on where Gertie spawns. So Gertie automatically takes damage then, but I think it might like get rid of the poops. So we got normal monster here, monster two sorry here who we kind of have to be careful of because of his laser. I didn't see that shot in the air at all, so it kind of caught me a little bit off guard. <sighs> Say let's be careful, and then what do I do? I just stand there and take the laser in the mouth. That's just standard how I play, like an asshole. I get sick items, I get carried. That's how I play. I don't play with good dodges or anything. Sadly, I wish I was better at dodging. Oh, wow, something just got like a... I guess pin was on one of the poops or something. Found herself a shiny dime. Or a nickel, sorry. We got the hollow and... What's his name? The... Oh, shit. What's it? Now I feel like an asshole. I can't remember his name. The hollow and... Duga flies times two. Twice as hard. Duga flies. That's all I know. So for... We might actually pop... Uh, Guppy's head for the second part of uh, Mask of Infamy here because our shots they, they should be fast but like when they get in tight they're slow so I, I kind of need kind of need to be able to hit him unless he killed himself somehow question mark I believe it he did so we got Pestilence here I'm going after Pestilence first just because I don't want him to blow up my defensive rocks that I have Yeah, there he is. Found you, famine. Yeah, there's enough room here that I can kill him before he even has a chance. Death. Death's going first just because I don't like death. And he spawns zombies. Killed his little horse right away somehow. Oh, no, I didn't. His horse is still flying around. I thought I got it. It just damaged me and flew away. Oh, ouchies. Ouchies again. I mean, I guess I'm okay with taking damage, considering I just generate more items, so it's not a big deal to me. Fallen is going rather quickly. And Fallen is gone. I would love the wafer from this. Undefined. And now I have unlocked Undefined. I got uh, Hot Bombs. If knowing I would receive hot bombs for doing this, I probably would have picked up sad bombs. Because then I would have some real sick bombs. But. You don't know that going into the fights, right? Hmm, okay. That's cool. I guess I can... I'm hoping for a telepills, actually. Bombs are key. Health up. I mean, good items. Good thing I, I used them. Like, I'm not sad about it. Let's see if we can't plow through this. Now oh, I can use Guppy's head a lot more. Because I'm not worried about saving it for a certain boss. Oh, wow. For some reason, that boss... Uh, boss rush seemed way more difficult. Yeah, apparently we're speedrunning right now, so... A little fun fact for you, I'm a... Uh, Vining of Isaac Speedrunner. But I don't use my Guppy's head efficiently. That's why I never won any championships. Never used my Guppy's head right. And I'm not a speedrunner. I'm going <laughs> I'm going back for the ski. And I don't know what the Tinder Rocks work like, so I'm uh, like that it bothers me so much. I don't know why. Cause it seems like something you should know. Oh, we already took damage. Petrified poop. Kind of cool. Oh, yeah. I got mom's coin first. Forgot about that. I could use two bombs to get t four bombs. I guess I will. And then I put this bomb here. Look at that. I get net gain two bombs. I mean, it's whatever. Two bombs in the end, probably not even going to use them. So, there's that, but... I found pills and telepills. Okay, this is a 
This is a room. We got the chariot. We could get some sick stuff out of this. Like that. That's. I'll take two spirit hearts. Fuck off spiders. Four spirit hearts. Bombs are key. And luck up. So we got the chariot. I think we're going to take the chariot. We're not taking that card generator. And the deck of cards because it does nothing good for me. I missed out on one item. It's whatever. Not a big deal. Got another spirit heart for just coming in here. Two keys for one spirit heart with 15 keys. I think it was worth it. Gurglings get messed up by flies. These little mumps. Oh, didn't get there fast enough. There we go. Well, I don't know what they're actually called, but they get fucked up too. Oh, oh, come on. There we go. Oh. And I can go down. But I feel like I can go on to fight Isaac? Question mark? I throw out a lot of question marks with my speech. Oh, oh, hello. These are the... This is a room where it's like, oh my good lord. Or is, uh, not my... I prefer pretty much any other room. Because there's so many enemies you can't even hurt. It's like, oh my goodness. Go away, please. One key to see what's in a red chest. Extra flies. Trading keys for damage, pretty much. That dingle disappeared rather quickly. As did that one. See, now this would be a sick room to know what uh, those rocks look like. Let's take a quick gander, see if I can't see an X in any of them. I see X's in all of them. So, yeah. There you go, that tells me what I could see. I see X's everywhere, not just in one spot. Mom's heart. I guess we gotta deal with those couple of guys there. And Mob's Heart will be gone shortly here. I did get hit three times out of it though. If I go in there, what happens? It's Mom's Heart. So, like, whatever, we're going down a shoal. Just because I'm not 100% positive. So we got Ipcac. That's one thing. We unlock two characters from this one. Wow, one shotting these assholes. Pretty good. Hot bomb. For nothing. <laughs> Pop some flies. Oh, all our flies went in and killed that thing, apparently. Oh. And we got homing bombs. Do we really have homing bombs? Or is that just a, an effect of uh, Sacred Heart? It makes everything we have homing. Ouchies, but he turned to poop. E. coli. Um, and a red chest with nothing good in it. I'm gonna blow up these skulls. Got the Hierophant. Which is a nice little item for us. Going to the big room. Don't really want to go to the big room, but... But we screw these enemies up pretty good, so... They don't actually have that much health. I guess we're going to big room number two. Adversary times two. Which is not what I was looking for, but... Apparently I do enough damage to... Deal with him. Rather quickly and efficiently. Good thing we do, because we gotta fight Satan, right? So hopefully hoping for some dead ends here. Oh jeez. I mean it came out even. I'm gonna blow up this little skull skull here. All we got was a host. Nothing good. No secret room there. I love the music on this floor. It's creepy. Okay, mega fatty. You got screwed. Because we're powerful. Oh, fucking greeds. 
Please go away, Greeds. I, th I think I can... Eh, we're gonna put a bomb down and just do that. Because our bomb's home as well, which I forgot about. And hopefully we do not get hit in this room. Um, and the last one's over there, but I can't can't find out a shot to get them. Um. Oh, hello. That wasn't cool of you. Hey, look at this. Then we get to get double flies going for Satan. I think that's good timing. Oh, come on. That was good timing. Like, it blew up right as he landed. Okay, get shit on, Satan. Apparently, I'm getting shit on. I swore at him, and he's like, No! You listen here, buddy boy. I guess we'll pop this. Okay, well, popping that didn't do a whole bunch. But a lot less than I thought it was going to. I thought that was actually going to fuck him up. Apparently, I was wrong. Very wrong. His feet have a lot of health. But not enough. Pick that up. And that is it for this episode. If you liked it, leave a like. And uh, also subscribe. You know, helps me out. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.